<laughs> what is going on? Wow, this is so weird. There's the airdrop. It looks like the same guy as um, the first guy I fought. Alright, welcome guys. This is the Safari Gamer and today is another day of survival. It's actually day one still, so I'm not sure why it's still day one. It should be day two. I think we should need to sleep. Okay. It should be day two. I'm not sure why it says day one. Because we did all this on day one and we killed someone in our first hand-to-hand -hand combat. There's the airdrop. Why are they airdropping and why am I a prisoner? Was being like left here on this deserted area. Very interesting. So it looks like the loot has been dropped there. And I just want to double check. I need another shank just in case. I'm probably going to get attacked. So we'll get that up and running. And we will swap that out, get a fresh boy. I need some more water. So I will. Drink that, and I'll need to eat as well. Oh, actually, I'm okay for now, but I'll put them there. And I guess we can head to the to the area. And I might as well collect some rocks, because you never know when I'll need them. It looks kind of far, 300, uh, 300 meters. Uh, although I can see the flare... So, hopefully not too far. And we'll close that out. But yeah, I don't know why this is day one. Hmm. Definitely is the morning, and I definitely had my shelter ready. I will take some meat, just in case. I'll need to cook that, but yeah. Take a stick. And we'll keep going. So there's my base. I wonder if we're gonna run into more prisoners. I'm guessing we will. So right now we're like in this regular forest area. There's a rabbit there, but I don't have like a bow and arrow or a gun to kill it right now. Alright, so 150 meters, we are nearly there. And we'll find out what special loot has been dropped. I don't know if I have a map. I, I, I tried to press M for the map, but I couldn't find it. But, oh my god, I see someone there. Yo, there's another, there's another prisoner there. I'm going to have to kill him. All right. This should be interesting. Hopefully he doesn't have the loot already. He looks like he's like chilling in that area, so I'm not sure. But I'm trying to go behind the trees so he doesn't see me, but who knows. Looks like he's guarding it. I'm gonna have to kill him, and I have my shank ready. I'm gonna have to shank him. When I say shank, guys, I mean my like little stone knife that I crafted. And I'm gonna attack! Oh. He looks like the same guy as um, the first guy I fought. And he's really not dying, and I'm stabbing him like multiple times. He literally destroyed my shank. Oh, I guess like it damaged it a lot. Let's see what he has. <laughs> Just making sure he's dead. Oh, that's sad. He has a plastic bottle, so I can fill some water up with that. That'll be good. That is useful for sure 
And here's my special loot. So let's see. Oh, nice. I got a gun. Some pills, a lantern. That would be helpful. Cloth. The magazines. Oh, and the nails are for a building. Let's see. I should probably eat first. Let, I can throw out the stick and then we'll use it for something else. Okay. And then I'll move everything up. I'll need to put my gun, probably the second one. So let's see. Reload. Nice. Okay, I am locked and loaded and I have a Glock. So we're ready for action and I have space to pick up the stick again. So that's cool. Ah, oh, what should we do? I'm wondering, the base is there, maybe we can just kind of explore. Um, I don't really see anything too exciting. There's like some yellow stuff there. I'm not sure what that's all about. But I do have to also build my base, so... We can see what the yellow stuff is there, and then we'll head to the base and build it up, and then maybe we'll walk along the coast to see if there's any like ships or like anything, any buildings. Right now I don't see anything. Okay, and the tip is to also to get back to craft a hammer so I can build a foundation. So yeah, they actually want me to go back. Okay, so this is just sand here. But I should probably get some more rope, probably need it. Oh, let's test out the, the gun. <laughs> I need the rabbit to stop running. Don't run so fast. Oh, what a shot. That was a shot. Indeed. I wasted a bullet though, but Celavi? Alright. I'm gonna just get rid of this. I'll get some meat. Can I stack this? No, I cannot. Animal skin will that be helpful and bone. Maybe. Never know. Okay. All right, so let's just get back to the base then, and we'll stop building. How many bullets do I have? I have 14 bullets, so... Potentially, if I have one bullet, bullet per kill, I can kill 14 people, but... We'll see. That prisoner took, like, a lot of, like, stabs, so I'm not sure one bullet will even, like, take care of them. So there's some more sticks here, but I can always cut down some wood. And this is where we started, but we should build the base like they said. I hope there's like a chest where I can store some stuff, like the pills I don't need to take, but we'll see. So we have come back to our little base and then let us start building stuff. So craft, wood foundation, I need more logs. And I'm going to throw that out. What else can I do? Workbench, I need logs as well. Fence, I need water. There's a lot I can build. A chest. Okay, I need to craft that. And then, let's see, our, which way is the chest opening? Probably here, maybe? And then, E to place. Got my hammer, and we build it. 
just so I, <laughs> excuse me, it's just so I can store um, some stuff. So we put some rock there. Actually, we need the rock to build. We should put like pills. Drop the lantern on the floor and press M to move it to the place you desired. Okay. I'll put the cloth there. We'll put that, the skin there. I'll put the can just in case and we'll put the plastic and we'll also just put that bandage. I need to cook the meat, but yeah. Drop the lantern on the floor and press M. Okay, let's drop it. And then press M to pick up and... Nice. So this actually provides some light as well. So we'll put that th there. All right, so our base is kind of coming along. I need to chop some wood down. So let's chop it. This tree. Okay, hopefully that's enough. So let's see, I craft. And, oh, I need one more log. So we have to let's cut down one more tree. And then we'll build our foundation somewhere here. Crop foundation. Yep, we will want to do this probably like here, maybe. Ah, okay. Okay, and then I need to switch to my hammer and we need to build. All right, so we built our foundation. So this is exciting stuff here. Wooden wall, doorway, and then I need more logs, basically. This is a lot of wood. Okay. Need to cut some more axes. I drank some water. I don't like that we're clearing all the trees. I like the trees actually, but whatever. Let's see. Are you going to let me build something? Oh. Okay. Let's place a wall window. Yes. Built. <laughs> look at that. So now I can look outside and not sure what I'll be looking at, but whatever. Let's see what else I can build. So I can build the wall window. It doesn't let me scroll down, but okay, whatever. So that's that. What else can I build generally? Uh, I can grow vegetables, medicine, material. Let's see, what else can I do? Workbench. I should start building a fence. 
Alright, I'm gonna start doing that. I need a lot of logs, so... And I'll go cut some more wood. I'll cut more wood here. I think we have enough to build a fence, so that'll be good. I'll drink some more water just in case. All right. And then let's do that. Craft, placeables, and then we'll build a fence. Man, it's going to take forever to build something. Probably like here. And then... <laughs> like, that's gonna stop everyone, you know? No one's gonna be able to enter my base. Let's see what else. Let's build some more. And uh, logs are issues here. Like, does it not like attach to this? Oh, that's weird. Okay, let's just rotate it. I need it to be like set. All right, right there. E, okay. And then build. Oh, I need my hammer. Nice. Wait, did I place this the wrong way around? Shoot! It's like the worst door ever. <laughs> Ugh. All right, whatever. I'm sick of this. <laughs> All right, that's the sunset. I think we'll call it a night. Let's see if we can on the lantern. Oh, yeah, it ons. Nice. So I have light. I should probably eat as well. Let's see how much protein. So we'll put that there. Our meats are about to get spoiled, so that's another issue. Enemy camp. Oh my god. Okay, let's go explore that. Let me sleep. And we'll go explore the enemy camp. In the, actually, let's explore the enemy camp in the next episode. Um, let me just build a roof over this. So we probably need a roof. Where is the dropship now? I don't see it. Does it not let me? No. All right, whatever. We, you know what? Let's just go attack. 
All right, we're going to end this episode by attacking the enemy camp. I have my weapon ready, and I'm going to go and try to loot whatever they have. So let's do this. They're only 450 meters away. <laughs> I have my weapon ready. I should have brought bandages, but, you know, I am a prisoner. I don't think about these things. I just want to go and attack, so. They're probably, like, chilled in their camp because it's, like, raining. They don't expect anyone to be running out in the rain. All right, we're nearly there. 3.50 soon enough. This is like the furthest I'm like gonna go. Hopefully no one goes to my camp. I should have also gone to get the loot because they might have been like better like weapons. But I only live once. I am a prisoner. Or well, I was a prisoner. And I don't care. Alright, I may just uh, cut this and forward it as we reach the camp. I don't want you guys to have to sit through me running all the way, so we'll be right back. <sighs> Alright guys, we have reached the enemy camp. I see someone. It's quite a big base, actually, and I saw one guy at least. So, alright, let's see what we can do. We're just going to go and try to attack this guy. He was outside. I wonder what's going to happen. This is a big base. Like, how did they build this? There's no windows, though, so I'm not sure what they're trying to achieve. He's inside. I can see his orange jumpsuit. I wonder if I could just shoot through, but I don't think I can. There's only one guy from what I can see. It says enemy camp, so I'm just gonna take that shot. Headshot. Haha. <laughs> See, it took like freaking so many shots. Wait, 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 are you getting up? Wait, what's happened? <laughs> what is going on? Wow, this is so weird. Get out of here. <gasps> he's alive! Yo, he's alive, he's alive, he's alive. Wow, this is like Terminator. What's going on? Man, this guy didn't want to die. He <laughs> took like so many bullets. Whoa, whoa, wait, 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 what? What, wait, wait, what? Yo, this guy is not dying. It's like a zombie. He had no loot as well. Wow. This is interesting. This is interesting. Alright, so he is dead. And we are into his base. Nice, at least he has more nails, so I'll take that. And he has duct tape. That's all he had? Oh, that was worthless. I wish I could, like... Oh, I think I'm dying. Oh, I'm getting sick. It's probably because I ran in the rain. All right, I need to get back to my base, so we're going to end it here. Um, that was interesting. Uh, we attacked our first enemy base, so... Thanks, guys, for watching, and we'll kind of um, touch base in the next episode. I'll probably just head back to the base now and we'll start back from there. So yeah, thanks guys. Give me a like and please subscribe if you like. Um, peace.